Once upon a time, in a, in a country called Japan, a little boy lived with his mum and his dad. Next to their house was a pond. The little boy loved playing in the neighbor's pond, but his mum did not like that very much. She was always afraid he might slip and hurt himself. One winter it was so cold outside. After playing in the neighbor's pond, the little boy came home and called his mum. Mummy, mummy, where are you? Mummy! But she did not reply. Mummy was busy folding origami paper. She was making paper crane. Mummy, what are you doing? Why are you making paper cranes? asked the little boy. This is a surprise, said Mummy. The little boy took a hot bath and went to bed. While he was lying on his bed, he heard his mum digging up his tree in the garden. Can you see the tree? This is the tree. Oh no, said the little boy. I wonder what Mummy is doing in the garden. It's so cold outside. She is going to be sick. I need to know what Mummy is doing. After a while, Mummy came back with a tree in a blue pot. Can you see the blue pot? And started hanging paper cranes on the little tree. She then told her son that when she was a little girl, she used to live in a different country. At this time of year in that country, Christmas was celebrated. Special trees were decorated with lights and globes. And under the trees, special presents and gifts were placed for the people we love and care. Oh, said the little boy, I would love to have a samurai kite. Oh, say mummy, well, Christmas is a time where you give and receive. It is a day of love and peace. Strangers smile at one another and enemies stop fighting. Mum put some candles on the tree and lit them. Our Christmas tree is so beautiful, said the little boy. The little boy thought very hard, I don't have money on me and I don't know how I can buy a present for mummy. But I know, I know what will make mummy happy. So the little boy promised that he will never go and play alone at his neighbor's pond or by himself. The next day, when the boy, when the boy woke up, Guess what he found under his Christmas tree? Can you guess? It was a samurai kite. Oh, so beautiful. Christmas is a time where we give and receive. This is a Christmas tree full of crates. So we've reached the end of our story. Hope you've enjoyed yourself. If you do have a special tree at home, you too, you can decorate your Christmas tree with origami crafts. Hope you've enjoyed yourself and hope to see you next time. Bye everyone. Bye.